Since the amazing discovery of Roman artefacts during the development of the new stand here at the Emirates Durham International Cricket Ground, Look North Eastley have been keeping up with the latest developments. How's that? It's here, deep in this ancient seat of learning. In the bowels of this highly appointed building and behind this very door, Dr Laverne Jones seeks to unravel the mysteries behind Gladiator Cricket. Yes please Helen, and once more, and again, and once more, experiment over. Hello? Uh, Helen, if you wouldn't mind uh, wiping down my helmet. Ha. <laughs> it's, uh, they're, they're refurbing, um, so it's not permanent. Oh, right, well, um, uh, Dr. Laverne Jones, uh, what Hello. exciting findings do we have uh, in, in, in relation to Gladiator Cricket, of course? Right, oh, well, uh, there is uh, this. Is that what I think it is? Are you a professor of antiquity? No. I am. Uh, we at first we, we thought this was a drinking vessel, um, an easy an easy mistake to make. On on further inspection, we realised it was actually um, a type of armour um, used by the gladiators in a in a particular area. Um, uh, you know, for between between the stumps, for the penis, to, it protects the penis and the testicles. Um, yeah. Uh, and, and in fact, on, on when, we, when we've studied this further, um, it, it was also used as an offensive uh, weapon as well. What would happen is the wearer would, would attack um, a fielder who's uh, hit the floor. They would attack them. Um, and aha, aha, uh, yes, this. Uh, also, the uh, la piste de la résistance, uh, as the, the French say, um, is... Uh, is this very wow? Well, that looks like a it looks like a piece of pottery. It is. It's but it obviously uh, to the untrained eye. Um, this is uh, this is part of an amphora, um, which would have been which would have been used as the stumps in the game, and and this actually would have been the ultimate prize. I thought the ultimate prize was freedom. No, no, it was this. And obviously, uh, what we think is that this actually the amphora was used uh, as the stumps, and if it survived, then the the prize was given to the gladiators, and and it's where we get the term overs from because this was the left overs. The overs have uh, have come from from here, uh, and of course, it it had wine in it. Oh right, so you've you've obviously found traces of wine on the pottery. No, not not yet. No. We will, we will, uh, once we, we get a, uh, the new laboratory and, and, and better equipment. Wow, well that, uh, it's hard to believe. Well, <laughs> as they say, um, history is, is made by the victors and victors are some history uh, is made up. Right, uh, well, thank you. Once again, Dr. Laverne Jones. Uh, well, well, maybe we can revisit when you've got more exciting findings in your new lab. No, no, you won't be allowed to. It's, it's a top security, so you wouldn't be able to come in. Right. Well, this is uh, this is Duncan Wilnot reporting for North Easterly News on the Enigma that is Gladiator Cricket. <laughs> Gladiator cricket. Not so much a game, but more a way to ruin your life. Duncan Wilnot, reporting for Look North Easterly.